Well, this morning I learned something that I didn't know before, so I'm going to teach it to the rest of y'all so that y'all will know it too. Y'all might remember a while back I hooked up the, oh, I hooked up the uh, ice maker and the new refrigerator. And I used PEX pipe. Some people call this stuff shark bite. Uh, it's it, it, There's two ways you can connect this. You can buy these little tees for about a buck, a buck and a half. There's a tool that will clamp a ring around it and seal them. That works really good. Never had one leak. Here's a ring right here that's sealed around one. They also make these press-in fittings, which I've never liked because I've had them leak before. And that's what happened with this one. I put these two half inches together, put this quarter inch copper pipe in there. Basically, you just press it in. These uh, plastic pipes have a little thing that goes inside the pipe, but the copper pipe, you just press it in. Well, after I did, it was leaking, and I was getting a bowl full of water every every night, uh, and it was getting like more and more. I just put this in here over the weekend, so you know I knew I had to fix it pretty quick. Well, I went to town, and I was looking for fixes because my local store where I bought that connector didn't have one, didn't have another one to replace it with. And I come across this little thing. It looks like a little orange horseshoe. You slip it right over this, you put your fingers on this, put your other hand on that and pull it, and it releases this thing so you can pull it out. So what I did was I pulled it out, I snapped it back in there, and it fixed the leak. It doesn't leak anymore. So there you go. I didn't have to unplumb all of that and replumb it, or I was afraid I was going to have to cut all these to get them loose. I didn't realize there was a mechanism to release that. So that worked out just perfect. And then this now I dropped it and I think it went back behind the crack there. So let's see if I see if I lost it or if I can get it out of there. But uh, let me reach back. Yeah, there it is. So that's what it looks like on this side. That's what it looks like on this side. They make one for a quarter inch pipe and make another for a half inch pipe. And that's just something I didn't know about. So for all of you at home plumbing guys, I'll just put that out there so you'll be aware of it so that. Maybe next time you have one leaking like I just did, you can, uh, if you have one of these, you can unplug it and replug it. And in my case, it fixed the leak. So, with that out of the way, I got other things I could be working on today. I think I'll go get busy with them. I'll start with cutting the grass. 